Hello guys, welcome to this episode of Kambi's channel. Uh, in this video, I wanted to show how you can unlock your uh, ET, that is Paras uh, token, ET. So, uh, <clears throat> we all know uh, what happens with uh, uh, Spiras ET. That is, uh, when the launch the coin the airdrop some tokens and then when you refer uh, subscribers you also get tokens i got about 60 dollars in total uh, that have been locked so uh, after you uh, perform all the activities to uh, unlock your et account uh, the last thing left to be done is to uh, trade futures. Now, uh, I tried something yesterday. I tried the futures yesterday to unlock my ET. And uh, uh, I want to show how it went uh, for me yesterday. So, uh, first of all, let me show my ET. Uh, my ET platform here. So this is my ET account. Um, so this is my ET account. So if you come here, um, where we where we perform the the task. Let me see here, Fera. We'll refer this to refer uh, subscribers. Uh, let me see uh, uh, where 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 we perform this. Uh, um, airdrop bees. Airdrop bees. I think it will be here. Exactly here. When you, when you come to airdrop base, you could see all I completed all these tasks. Inside Sana for Sparrows, I got 580. Then follow up, followers on Twitter completed. Join our official Telegram group completed. Uh, start deposit completed. Imme immediately enter future transaction. So you can see congrats. That was yesterday after I, 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 I traded futures. You know, congrats because I did it yesterday. Congrats. And when you click on it, uh, illegal operation. Okay, there's nothing because I did it yesterday. Begin spot transactions. That one I also completed it. Just how, but it was just about deposit some ten dollars on your spot account. So introduce uh, a friend, sign up uh, five dollars. I invited one, but this one I don't know why. It's still there. I can see I refer one. I don't know, maybe I had to refer more. But the point is here to unlock your ET account. One is to trade futures. So yesterday, like I was saying yesterday, I did it. And uh, uh, so this is my reward 2780. Uh, locked 27. And then unlock 0 0.06. So that's what I think I was able to unlock yesterday. Uh, yes, so uh, let me show. Let's see my ET uh, wallet first, and let's see what is there before we go on to the futures trade. So here we are. As you can see, I have ET sixty eight. Let's check the available the available ET. Let me see withdraw. When you click on withdraw, you see available. Uh, my available ET is here. This is what's available for me. Zero point uh, yeah, zero point nine. It's available for me. That's what I can withdraw. I think after every day after locking, that's what I, I I it's what that's what's available for me now. Uh, zero point nine. Meanwhile, I have about twenty seven. I have about twenty seven. Uh, locked as you can see our 
0.8437 and uh, I only have within this I have only 09 available right okay so let me show quickly here what happened yesterday yesterday let's yesterday I yesterday I I traded futures like I was saying I traded futures as you can see on this on this screen I open I will show how you can also trade futures uh, uh, yesterday I set the price to 17,400 for BTC the contract is BTC USDT that is the US uh, BTC US USDT that is the contract so uh, the price the market price was the uh, at the entry the market price was 17409 let me show uh, the, the price at the time uh, i at the time i started that is the price here is here is the price so here is the price the price is here this is the price 17409 right 17409 and the i 17409 so i took this position i took this position uh, i took this position i took this position uh 17 17 I took 17,400 instead of 17,4093. So the entry price, the price was at 17,409.3. That was the BTC price. So I, to, I set the limit at 17,400. That's the limit I set. So meaning if the price drops up to 17,400, I'll be in. Uh, 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 in, 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 in profit so uh, uh, the, the system has closed for me to take the profit right or close it and send the profit into my wallet right so i set the price 17400 and the entry was 17409 right so the short uh, uh, then uh, the leverage the leverage is here 30 times it was the maximum is 150x so i took 30x to limit the risk that's what I, I took. Then uh, the margin, cross or isolated, I took isolated. So we'll come to isolated, uh, uh, isolated, cross and split. And you see what, what, what is it. So I took isolated. And then uh, I now uh, took the short position. This one. I took this one. I took this one. That is short. Yeah. S. Yes. If I, I took long position, you will see B uh, in green here. So I took short position yesterday. So and then after a time, you can you you you, could, you can see here that uh, the price dropped to from seventeen thousand four oh nine here. It dropped to seventeen three five six point two. Right, meaning that I've I've, I went into profit. So you can see the return on equity here, 9%, 9.37%. And the PNL, the profit is this one, 30. So you see the price, the market price dropped to 17,352, 356.2. While I said 17,400 and I took short position. Short position meaning that I predicted that the price will go down. And uh, Totally, totally, the price went down to from 14409 to 17356. Exactly, it went down, and then I was able to make some profit. So that was, that was what happened yesterday. So I waited, and uh, let's clear this one. I waited, and uh, uh, after that, it dropped more. As you can see here, it dropped more. As you can see here, as you can see here, it dropped from 17,356 to 
326 yeah this one 326 you know 326 17 326 so you drop to 17 326 yeah this one oh this one this one 17 326 so from 17356 it dropped to 17326 and you could see that the profits the return on investment has increased from 9% something to 40% and the PNL was 047 right and then you can see the set the limit price are set 17400 that was it and the entry was this you know so the price dropped to here meaning that i made more profit so that's how come yesterday I was able to unlock some 80 but uh, the point here is not regardless of profits or loss you unlock your 80 you just have to set some features and then you unlock it profit you may profit you might uh, 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 loss once you trade features you unlock some 80 so now the quantity you unlock is what is important here. Yeah, the quantity to unlock, that is what is important here. And then it depends on the features, the amount of features you, you traded. Yes. I will show you the message I got from uh, the support when uh, I, I didn't understand the metrics or certain things. You understand? So, once again, I'm repeating it. It doesn't matter you make some gains, you make some loss. No. Once you set the futures, you pay some fees. And then the fees you are going to pay will determine the amount of ET you unlock from your account. You understand? So, uh, uh, let me show you how to uh, set the features and then i'll come back and read what the support gave me yesterday about uh, the quantity you can unlock based on the, the amount of fees you pay for the future trading so here we are let's go to my to my platform let's go to each platform here and then i will show you how to trade so one, first of all when you come is that is the home page right so you come down here wallet come down here on wallet you come down here on wallet come down here on wallet here yeah, wallet uh, you come here to wallet so wallet wallet yeah here is wallet so here you see your wallet here so wallet is here down here that's why i click yellow the yellow here down here wallet so when you come to wallet you come to wallet here then you come to overview uh, uh, this is wallet overview the wallet overview right okay i have uh 73 there so let's see um, so uh, here you come to spot here here so click on spot so click on spot you click on spot at the top here overview spot then you see your wallet you see your wallet 
I have the ET has taken some value just now. The ET has increased in value. The price has increased more. So here we are. Um, the ET uh, withdraw. Okay, that's available. So I was saying you come to uh, wallet, wallet, then you click on sports at the top here. At the top here, so to see your ET, right? So, uh, you click now, uh, on uh, to see your the available coin you have in your wallet. So, sports. So, you see, I have USDT here, my USDT here. This is the USDT. I have some USDT here. I have some USDT here. That's it. I have some USDT here. So we we'll have to transfer this USDT to future wallet. Number one. We transfer the USDT to future wallet. Number one. Good. So for that, we click on here. Wallet. Uh, uh, we click on we click on transfer at the top here you can see transfer at the top here beside uh, deposit and withdraw so click on transfer right click on transfer so you see from future wallet to sports so we change it here we change it here we change it here you see you change this one to you change it to from sport to future wallet you click here click here you see it has changed to from sport to future wallet right so now we can transfer the usd because it was it, was, it is in our sports wallet so we have to transfer from sport wallet to future wallet so here we can now See that the amount we want to transfer. So I have six point uh, eight. So let's transfer some uh, six dollars to the spot to uh, from the spot to the future wallet. So six, and then I confirm transfer successful, right? So now we can go to our future our futures wallet to see the amount we transfer there. So you can see for transferring, I think we pay some fees. So we have a 5.87 is it margin balance six dollars you know that's what we transfer and i think we pay some fees and then it is uh around uh, uh five eight so now we have transferred our usdt to the future wallet Use ET for fees. Ten percent discount. Okay, good. So, uh, uh, use ET for fee. ET for fee transfer. ET futures account. ET to futures account. You can use ET to the the dot uh, service fee and enjoy ten percent discount. Okay, let's try to transfer the ET to to see if it will go. So here. Okay. Transfer. Et. Okay, we don't have available uh, properly uh, in our account to transfer. Transfer. Let's change here to Et to see if it will be transfer. It's available zero. So, okay, available. Let's change this one to see. So available is uh, 0 0.9. Available. So the lock is locked. So I can transfer this one to the spot, uh, to features uh, wallet, to features wallet so that I can use to pay fee. So let's transfer this one to mass. Let's transfer it. Okay. So all have been transferred to feature wallet. So now, after transferring the ET and the USD to, to future wallet, uh, let's see our future wallet here. 
as you can see is now uh, eight dollars fourteen because we transfer zero point nine here as you can see under eighty zero point nine and the six dollars so the eighty equivalent in dollar usdt plus the usdt we have eight so now let's now move to futures so to to go to futures trade you click on futures here down here that is the yellow dashboard so features so this is the interface so the future trade interface it is this one so you, as you can see the contract uh, comes uh, just automatically with btc you can change the contract to maybe etc you just have to tap it here click at the top on the contract there you click here let me show where you should click so you click at the left uh corner the top left corner here on the, these three dots click here just click here and then you see future usdt every feature so you tap whatever you want if i want eth you can see eth usdt perpetual so it will come so i can select this contract you can see the top eth usdt but i want to do btc so let's be with the btc btc contract so here so number one you select the contract now after selecting the contract you can see the cross and the uh, margin mode here so cross margin mode or cross position under the same margin assets share the same assets cross margin balance so in the event of in the event of liquidation your asset full margin balance along with any remaining open position under the asset maybe of it there. so simple put if you take cross and then you open maybe different contracts uh, btc usdt for an amount and you open again maybe for long position and you come open again btc usdt for short position or you take btc usdt for uh, one of the position long short and you take it uh, eth usdt then you take bnb uh, usdt so if you open several position and you take cross Meaning that if one you you made loss somewhere, you if you made loss somewhere, it means that it will going to affect the other set uh, uh, contract. That is the cross margin. You understand? So the loss if it, it can affect all the other set uh, uh, contract. Isolated isolated margin margin assigned to a position is restricted to a certain amount in the if the margin rate is less than. Or equal to zero so the position is liquidated however you can add or remove margin at the will under this method right so with isolated you can add more uh, margin more contract but just are isolated when you make loss somewhere when the the, the loss happen it will not affect the other uh, contract so that is the uh, meaning of uh, the isolated margin mode so the split margin transfer a certain amount of margin to corresponding account if the margin rate is less than zero or equal to zero the position will be liquidated so under the trader and the trader may lose all the margin in the account so uh, you have the choice here to transfer if you open split so mean that you can transfer if you you open more than contract you can transfer the amount from one contract to another you know but just that when liquidity the liquidation uh, happens you you, you make some loss then everything will go so uh, uh, that's why uh, most of the time people take as you when they open uh, more, uh, more more than one contract but under normal because if you open one contract you can just go for cross margin right so let's come back to the features so like i was saying cross is on cross so this is the leverage so as you can see the leverage is maximum is 150s so once you you see selecting a uh, higher leverage the, in the red we read selecting a uh, higher leverage such 150s increases your liquidation risk always manage your risk levels see our help article for more information so here you can drag this to to choose or to select your margin yesterday i took 30 percent right to 30 percent so let's let me take uh 60 percent here uh, today 
and um, uh, let me take no let me take 40 or 50 percent let me take 40 50 percent you take 50 percent right uh, uh, leverage and then let me set the limit right now the btc is 18940 so let me take uh, like let's like say uh, 970 right let me take 18.9 let me set it to 18.9 9.70 something like that 9.70 then I so six dollars times for 50 that's 300 dollars the leverage I said I have six dollars times the little 50 I have uh, uh, 30 uh, 30 hundred you know set so let's take long position here let's take long position here and wait to see what will happen so this is it so right now i already 0.18 percent because it's going up the entry you can see 18.953 the entry there the entry price there the entry the entry 18.953 and then the market right now is 18.959 right uh -huh. meanwhile i set i set the press the limit at 18.970 so if it hits 18.970 it means that i can have some gain you understand so it will it in under normal circumstances the the, the 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 trade must close and then i get the profit so the limit the limit here no information from the limit so yesterday i was told to uh set the limit automatically so that when it hits the 19 uh the 18970 it will close it will close. right now you can see that the market price is now 18 940 940 uh, uh yeah 18 949 so it's going down that's why i have this minus 1.58 percent yeah so it's going down so i'm, I'm making some, some 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 loss so uh i've taken long position that's why uh i'm waiting for it to go the way to uh 19870 but it's going down so as you can see the liquid the liquidating price the liquidating price is here uh, it's here it's here 18726 so meaning that if the price goes down goes down up to 18726 i'll lose my my funds everything that i put in a future wallet will go or what i've set here all will go i'll lose my funds so if the price goes down to 18726 then i'll be liquidated so that's why i'll not i'll, I'll not wait till it get there so if small time i see that no the way uh, the price movement is not good i can close my my trade here I can just click here. I can just click here to close. I can just click here to close the trade and wait for uh, some time, then open another position. So that's how the futures uh, work here with SPAR. Yes. So, uh, like I was saying, so let's hold on a bit to see the trend, how it will go. Right now, as you can see, is 18938 so it's going down the entry was 18953 and now it's 18931 so it's going down meanwhile i've taken long position as you can see here long position b by long position that's b if i have taken short position to be s all right so let's see what will happen in the next few uh, minutes uh, i just mentioned that here regardless of gains or profits you unlock your 80 once you open the trade when you open futures you pay some fees that's how you pay some fees so when you close the trade once you close the trade you open the trade and then you close it and it means that you have done one session of the trade then you you pay some fee or some 
a future student fee. So that fee will determine the quantity, the amount of ET that will be unlocked from your account so that you can withdraw it. So let me show you how it is calculated that unlock ET. Uh, so uh, right now we are we are we are we are we are minus seven percent, but uh, there's no cost for alarm because the liquidity price is eighteen seven two six, right? So let's go. Let me show you uh, how you determine your how you can determine your uh, how you can determine your yes here. Yeah. So here is it. Let me read quickly for you to understand. It is given to real cryptocurrency trading users, not to be distributed for free without any requirement. In which case, it will be worthless. Exactly. If it's just for free, just like that, you refer people. You have hundred. Some people have up to thousand. Then you just have to be given to you for free. No, I think the, 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 the system will collapse, right? So it will be gra gradual. Rather than that, we will come back and shout, rag pull, rag pull, rag pull, rag pull again. So here is it. Futures trading by you or the user you invite you invite will unlock your ET. So future, future, uh, futures, uh, futures trading futures trading or people you invite someone you invite who unlock your et so et unlocking formula so this is the unlocking formula right the unlocking formula is here trader or referrer trader slash referrer unlocking et amount equal to future trading so trader referral unlocking amount equal to future trading Good. So continue. So uh, okay, trader referral unlocking amount, unlocking ET amount equal to future trading fees. So they continue. So unlocking ET amount equal to future trading. Equal to future trading fee times unlocking difficulty. So note it very well. This formula unlocking ET. That is the quantity you want to unlock. The quantity you want to unlock equal to your fee, the trading fee, future trading fee, times unlocking difficulty. The unlocking difficulty is already set here, 0 0.8, 0 0.5. That is the unlocking difficulty set by the system. It's by default. It's the standard. That, that's the standard for this one. 0 0.5. Unlocking difficulty. So 0 0.5 times the fee that you pay for your trade over the price of the 80 current 80 price so the price of the 80 times 0 0.8 so 0 0.8 also is fixed is standard so right now two things are going to determine your your your, your the quantity you can unlock it is the trading fee and then the 80 price the trading fee and the current 80 price these two things are going to determine the quantity of ET you can unlock from your ET account. So here we are. Referrer. Referrer means uh, I am a member. I've subscribed to the platform and I refer someone. So I am the referrer. I, the person who invited someone through my link, I am the referrer. So the one I invited is called referral. Referral. And I am the referrer. Good. So referrer. Referrer is Referral unlocking it amount equal to future trading fee times unlocking difficulty over uh, current ET price times 0 0.2. Right? Exactly. So, meaning if, for instance, the trader referrer, you say the trader referrer, referrer, trader or referrer, someone I invited. So, is unlocking is this one. So if that person unlocked, traded, and unlock, automatically I also be unlocked. Someone I invited. If that person trade, the fee he pays to trade to unlock certain quantity, automatically, because I invited him, automatically I will be also 
unlocked. I also be uh, my, my account will also be unlocked for me to get some 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 quantities. So that's what they are saying referral. So if the referral, the one I invested, the trade traded, and then this formula here apply to him that the fee he pays times zero point five over the price of the each the current price of the eighty times zero point eight. That is the person I invited. Once he unlocked this one, I also have this, the second one, as referral unlocked for me. So that is the fee used by the referral, the person I invited, times 0 0.5 over the current ETH price times 0 0.2. So for example, that's the example going. I invited B. I, a, a, for example, A, A invited B. And A is the referral. So A is the referral and B is the referral. Good. So, so A invited B, A, A invited B, A, A is the referral, B is the referral. So that's what I'm saying. So uh, the person who invited is the referral. So A invited B, so A is the referral, and B is the referral. So if A has 20 USDT trading fee in future trading, ET price is 2 USDT, the amount of ETA will unlock is 20 times 0 0.5 over 2 times 0 0.8 equal to 480. So that's the formula apply here. So first, if B traded and the fee is 20, this formula apply to him and the I will also unlock, but the formula instead of 0 0.8 times 0 0.8 to be 0 0.2 for me. But if I am the referrer who traded, so that is the, 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 the example given here. So A, as a referrer, me, if I have $20, if I have $20 or 20 USDT trading fee in future trading, each price is 2 for me. So each, and the each current price is 2. USDT right now ET price is 2.4. So if ET price is 2, so the amount of e for e of ET I will unlock is 20, the trading fee, times 0 0.5. Unlocking difficulty 0 0.5. That is fixed, it's standard. So unlocking difficulty 0 0.5 over 2, that is the price of ET times the 0 0.8, which is standard. So I will have for ET. But if if B has twenty dollars trading fee in future trading because I invited B, so if B rather have uh, uh, B has twenty uh, trading fee in future trading uh, twenty dollars in future trading, ET price is two. That is the current price of ET is two. The amount of uh, ET uh, the amount of ET A will unlock as a referral is. So that's what I was saying. So if B has the if I am the I'm the one trading, I have twenty dollars at trading fee. Then I have I will unlock four eighty. So, but if it B is the one trading, it has twenty as fee. So the unlocking system will be applied to me as the referral of B, and that is the what the, the example they are giving here. If B has twenty USDT trading fee in future trading, eighty price is two, and the current price of eighty. The amount of ETA will unlock as a referral is 20 times unlocking difficulty 0 0.5 over 2, the current price of ET times 0 0.2. So, 1. That is it. So, if I am the one trading with $20 uh, 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 trading fee, so I will, I will unlock uh, 4 ET from my account. That's I will unlock 4 ET from my account as the one trading with. ET price being two, so that's why I'm saying that two things will determine the price because the unlocking difficulty is 0 0.5 already fixed standard, and the the uh, the uh, the uh, the 0 0.8 is also already fixed, right? So now the trading fee twenty dollars, and the price of the current uh, the current price of ET to will determine so if the your fee is 10 usdt your fee is 5 usdt 
So you do the calculations. If your fee is one USDT, you do the calculation. That will be one over two. That will be one times zero point five over two times zero point eight. You understand? If the price of the ET changes, for example, if the price of the ET is five, so you do the calculation. So twenty times zero point five over five times zero point eight. So it all depends. You understand? So that is the the way you can unlock your your uh your et guys so uh, let's come back to our trade let's see what is happening here let's see what's happening here so you see you see you see you see you see you see there is an over 10 i have 10 percent already so the price the, the, the entry price was 18.953 and now the current the current price is 18.997 so i've made 11.52 percent as you can see, I set the limit to uh, 18, uh, 9, is it 18,970. That was the price I face it to. 18,970. Now we are 19, 0 point, you can see 13 point, 13 point 16. I've gone to 16.17 percent for taking low position. <coughs> so you can see that I'm making some good profit here. I'm making some good profit here. I'm making some good profit here. Twenty percent. Drop down to fifteen. Twelve percent. Nine percent. So you see, so that's how you make some profits on this platform. 18%. 17. Let's see if it gets to 20, they will close. 17. 19. 16. <laughs> So you see 14, 14, 17 again, 18, 17. So I just want to close the, the position and then I will show you. Normally, the limit should be set somewhere. Uh, I think I have to set the limit here. For it to stop automatically, I have to set the limit here. So, like, uh, I open the limit. I put the limit price, 19, 18, 970. That is the, the position I've taken with the limit price. So, if it goes beyond that and I want it to close, I have to set it here also. Right? I have to set it here. Stop at this price. So, if it goes through... The limit I set and it goes to a certain amount. No, it can close. I can close. I can put the amount there so that it will close automatically. Not, I don't need to come and close it manually. You understand? So I have to put the price here, which I didn't do. But let's come back and close our position and see uh, the what we made. So as you can see, we are already twenty six percent, twenty four. So let's close it and see. Close. Close it. Confirm close. Good. Order successful. So I've closed my book. And then let's come to history. To come to see the history of what we have made as gain. So we come here. Top here. Come to the top here. And click on it. You click on the three dots. So click here. Uh, click here history click other history as you can see BTC UTC perpetual close long market <coughs> show completed at 19 104 that's what I've completed 
So uh, I pay as uh, I use ET to pay the fees. Uh, ET 0.06 ET instead of USDT. I think if I use USD is better because the USDT you still pay 0.06 uh, dollars. But with ET ET 0.06 is is quite expensive because ET alone is two dollars something. You know. So uh, this is the trade. So uh, I pay 0.06 ET. And the price uh, here, amount 300 results. Uh, the profit made should be mentioned somewhere here. Oh. PNL zero. Uh, no wait. Uh, something is. Completed twelve plus eighteen seventeen. Yes, this was uh, yesterday. This was yesterday. Clear history. That's it. So, yeah. So trade history. You come to other history to see all the orders you set. And then you click on trade history to see what you made. So price 19107 uh, where we close the close long position at 19107 uh, where we set it to 18 something. So amount uh, 300. So that's the with the leverage. So fee pay this and then the realized profit is 243 dollars. So that's it. That's what I just I just close you know so this is the detail down here open 19 I open it the entry is 953 uh, and I set it to uh, 18970 and uh, I close at 19 something so the fee paid is 0 0.06 and the uh, realized profit uh, is what is uh, giving uh, here, here two dollars forty three uh, here. So uh, that is how futures is traded. So let's see my ET account. Welcome to wallet spot. So the ET, the ET because I pay some fee. You can see that the ET has dropped to twenty six. It was twenty eight uh, something when we started. So now it's twenty six. So let's see uh, the future account. What I have in future, you can see we are having eight. So let me take it here. We are having eight something when we started the future. So because I've made two dollars something, so it is now ten dollars twenty six. You can see, right? So uh, that is how the future is, and uh, uh, like I was saying, uh, that is uh, the profit I made. So for doing this, I will unlock some. Some 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 eighty. That's an hour log. So so some eighty. Uh, because we we twenty six. Uh, let me see. Let me come back to to home and uh, add drop base. Add drop base. I uh, should have noted this one down. What? But let's see. Let's see. Let's see here. <coughs> So 27 log 26.9 and log 0 0.06. Uh, okay, maybe if we take our fee, the fee paid for the futures. Let's come to history, history, other history, fees. You see, we pay some 0 0.06 uh, ET fee. So we convert this one to dollars. To see the USDT dollars, so that's the the fee would have paid. So let me take the uh, that's the fee would have paid, and this fee in the USDT will get the fee pay in USDT. So that fee over the current price of USDT, uh, that the fee over the uh, the fee times the allocated difficulty that is zero point five, zero point five over eighty. So if we take let's say we are taking 
uh, over the current price of ET. So let's say we take 0 0.06 times 0 0.5 since it's in ET, and then we are going to divide it by ET again, the current price of ET. Let's put it that way. So let's take 0 0.067 times 0 0.5 over the current price of ET times 0 0.8. Good. So uh, let's get the calculator here. Let's get the calculator here. Let's get the calculator here. So I have 0 0.0 007 times the unlocking difficulty 0 0.5 equal to this. So over the current price of 80. So what's the current price of 80 now? The current price of 80. The current price of 80 is 2.39. So over over two point three nine now times zero point eight. That's it. Zero point zero eleven will be the quantity of ET I would have unlocked. Yes, which exactly I'm sure I, I, I unlocked from the trading I just the future trading I just made. I just want to see exactly where i can get that exact, that, that exact amount which i'm looking for but basically that is how you 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 come uh, uh that's how you, you 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 do the trading you know the future trading you know so guys uh, that's it if you have any question any difficulties whatever you want to ask question just drop in the comment section and then we'll take it from there i can forward it to the support and then we'll have some good uh, uh, feedback on it so guys thank you for uh, being with me and uh, you also try something five dollars three dollars four dollars just try and then see what, what, what how much you can unlock from your et account very very simple okay so thank you once again if you are new to the channel please subscribe to the channel and turn on notifications so that you don't miss any of our release thank you for watching and keep safe.